sweat the technique. Hey, what's up guys? Uh, back again with a new video for the iPod Touch. Uh, pretty psyched about this one because I finally got a case for my new iPod. They have finally released them. There's only a couple of them available, only a couple styles to choose from. But I found one that I liked. It was affordable, definitely. And uh, this one is by Griffin. Here, I'm just going to actually give you the box right now. This one, whoop, gotta zoom out. Hold on a second. There I run away. Everything's backwards. We're gonna hope on the video that you guys see this normal. But anyway, um, yeah, this one is by Griffin. It's called the iClear Crystal Clear Case with Armband and Clip, which is a, it's actually a really good bargain. Um, this is the case for the second generation iPod Touch, and um, the contents of the case are a microfiber cloth. It's uh, a pretty good one. It's embroidered with Griffin, if you can read that, possibly. So, microfiber cloth, and then you get the case, of course, obviously. And uh, the case is pretty good, actually, I'm not going to lie. Uh, it's plastic. It's not like a rubber gel or anything, but uh, it's not too thick, it's not bulky. It leaves great access to all your keys. You have the home button right here. You have the volume rocker switch, which is very easy to access to. You have the uh, sleep wake button, also easy to access. The 30 pin uh, USB or the 30 pin adapter, my bad. And then the headphone jack. And then that seems to be about it. So yeah, um, along with this package, aside from getting the case that comes with it, the plastic case, is that you get a screen protector. Um, it's not right screen protector. It's not bad. So you come along with the package. I would definitely say uh, to use it. Why not? Um, the only problem that I had is that I've bought um, screen protectors for products before. Um, I have one for my cell phone, and the only problem that I had with this one was this one was very hard to apply. Um, you can apply, but I don't know if you can see right now, there's a lot of bubbles, a couple of bubbles at the bottom, and uh, I used a credit card, I used a couple different things to try and get all the bubbles out. Uh, it was too hard. I had to take, pick it up and put it down a couple times. And uh, the screen protector gets a lot of bubbles. But you know what? It's a good screen protector. It's not thick. It's not sticky. It still has great access to all the keys and everything like that. So, yeah. It's a really great case. It's $24.99, and I picked it up at Best Buy because the Apple Store still does not have any cases in. So, it's kind of starting to fall behind. And, uh, yeah. So, along with the package, aside from getting the plastic case the screen protector, you also get a clip. And uh, this clip can either be a belt clip, as you can see right here, just an easy spring belt clip, or it can also be a stand. Now, I'm not gonna, actually, yeah, you know what, let's put this one right now. Twist push. Ooh, this is kinda tough. Holy shit. <laughs> it's supposed to just be push and feel and snap. All right. Uh, we'll do that one later, maybe, I guess, if I feel like it. I don't have any use for it. But anyway, apparently this is, uh, let's see how you can do it. Here we go. Here's the setting, so that when it is clipped in the back, you can leave it like this, somehow. You know what, guys? I don't know how the hell to do this. Here we go. It's locked. So this is on my bed, so my bed is tilting back the other way. Let's see if we can inflate and straighten it out. You know what, guys? Don't worry about it. This clip is also supposed to be used for, um... How the fuck do I do this? This is a tough clip to get used to, I'm not gonna lie. Oh shit, if I break it, I'm gonna flip. Alright, I'll read the instructions later. Alright, so also, with this uh, package, you get um, an armband. So if you want to have the clip go onto your arm, then you can just... Yep, so you can run with it. Uh, the armband is a ridiculously tight Velcro. Uh, can't see right there, but I had earlier. It's a, it's a really good Velcro, so uh, you won't have a problem running with it. Um, anyway, man, I'm kind of bummed about this. I know it's not broken, because I had it like this earlier. But, uh... I'm just trying to figure the fuck out how to get this back. Good thing I'm not a runner, because I'm not going to need this. But, uh, yeah. Well, this is gay. Um, so anyway, yeah. This is a uh, case made by Griffin called the iClear. Um, contents, the iClear case, which is in my iPod right now. You get the belt clip, which is what we just saw. You get the armband, which is this little dealie. 
You get the Static Peel Screen Protector, which is what this was. Uh, and you get the Premium Cleaning Cloth, which was the Embroidered Griffin Microfiber Cloth. Uh, yeah, so this is a, a great product, I would definitely say. It's $24.99 from Best Buy. The only negative thing that I could find about it was the screen protector about how there's a, ridiculous large, a ridiculously large amount of bubbles on it. But uh, aside from that, I mean, that's not really their fault. Screen protectors usually do have air bubbles in it, but uh, I guess with some use it'll get rid of it. But uh, yeah, the screen protector is not bulky. It doesn't add too much weight to it, barely any at all. Uh, it's clear, so you can still see your beautiful iPod underneath it. Um, great for shock, great for grip still, it's not slippery or anything like that, and the, all the buttons are definitely easy to access. You have every single button that you can get to in about a tenth of a second, so yeah, we're good. No problems with that. Um, other than that, it's really all I can think of. Uh, so yeah, $24.99 from Best Buy. This is the Griffin Eye Clear case uh, for the new iPod Touch 2G. Uh, hopefully you can go to your new, uh, local Best Buy and pick one up. Thanks. Cool, really quick. Uh, just figured out the belt clip. Really simple, I was just an idiot and didn't know how to figure it out. Uh, so here we go, here's the belt clip so you can push it back. And uh, you, this little slide tab right here that I was trying to fiddle with earlier, you push it down to lock it. So then it'll be locked like in this position. And in this position, then you will be able to set it up on a table and view it as a stand. Or if you want to push it back, you pull back and then you push this little tab again, push it down. And there you go. Now you're back into the belt clip mode or the armband mode with this spring. So, sorry, a little two seconds just to help and uh, show you guys I didn't break it. I was just an idiot and didn't read the instructions. Always read your instructions, guys. See ya.